Welcome back. This is Chili Davis, and I'm back to another video. I want to welcome back all my subscribers and welcome to my new viewers. This is a channel where we talk about my top stocks. Well, today, some of the top stocks were tech. Uh, the rally was late. It started about uh, 3 o'clock or 4 o'clock, depending on which time stand you're on. Uh, but it started late in this session. We had UPST Upstart Holdings tick up about 11%. Uh, then we also had AMD uh, tick up about 6%. We also had Microsoft late tick up 2%, but it was not such a simple day. The day actually opened with Microsoft up about 3%, and then later it dipped and came back up. So let me show with you. I posted this today. Uh, this was about an hour ago, and this was in the middle of the day. Look at that. Microsoft was trading flat at 0.33% early in the day. And prior to that, the uh, SQQ and the UVX were having a great old time. The volatility index was up. So both of those two, UVXY, were up high early in the day. Also, the SQQ was up as well. But then as the day went on, they cooled off and the stocks went up. Tech rally, UPST went as high as 11%, as you saw there, that I posted there on my Instagram. And earlier in the day, uh, just posting stocks. So uh, you can see early in the morning, uh, things about six hours ago, early in the morning, things were up, but then they dipped. Okay, so that's just something to look at. Uh, when you look at the stock market, it is not a single up and to the right. It is always an up and down, and then maybe an up and to the right. Or sometimes it's an up and then down and then, you know, flat. Uh, but today with the great in the portfolio, uh, Robinhood, as you can see, was up 2.12% on the day. Uh, everything was great uh, late in the day. As you can see, things rallied on late. Uh, if we take a look at the CNBC, uh, we'll see that uh, the Dow and the NASDAQ were both up. Uh, it is still earnings season. Uh, we do have AMD to report tomorrow. Uh, AMD uh, will report tomorrow uh, their earnings. Also, we do have the Fed speaking this week. Um, and look, it looks like the futures are already negative, but we do have the Fed speaking later this week, uh, anticipating an interest rate hike. So uh, be careful, guys. This may not be what we think it is. This may be a pump fake. Okay, so... Uh, as you can see, you had Fed Charles Powell. Uh, he is, and we are anticipating that they will uh, hike rates uh, later this week. They will announce that they may do that. If they do, then stocks may fall back again. Okay, so uh, let's go back to the uh, Robinhood portfolio and let's look through here and see which other hot stocks there was. Uh, we have Shopify uh, was up 6.59%. Uh, they will also report later this week uh, with AMD and Upstar Holdings, as I mentioned earlier, got as high as 11%. Uh, Coinbase, uh, ticker symbol COIN, Coinbase was up 7.88%. Uh, what else do we have here? Uh, Robinhood was up slightly today, 6%. Also, Tesla did come on late in the day as well. Uh, Tesla was up late in the day, up 4% on the day. So it was a pretty good day on Tesla. Also, I'd like to thank whoever used my link. Uh, someone used my link. So through Robinhood, I actually got uh, $5.82 worth of Tesla. So whoever used my link below the video, thank you again for doing that because uh, I got $5 worth of Tesla for that. So thank you. Uh, so uh, these were the top stocks, as I mentioned earlier today, just a few moments. Um, Tesla was the 4.28%, uh, but I probably would say UPST, uh, Upstar Holdings was the top at almost 11%. And again, like I said, if we look at the chart, it was not an up and to the right. It was kind of like down about 11 o'clock. And then as the evening, afternoon went on, it went up and to the right. But for the most part of the day, we were not sure what uh, Upstar Holdings was going to do. 
Uh, but by the end of the day, it was up and to the right. So that's where the 11% came in. Upstar Holdings uh, was the top stock of the day. Uh, I, I do have a position in Upstar Holdings, but it is not as large as I like. And I think with tech, uh, you got to be careful. So uh, right now I'm doing a lot of promotion on dividend stocks, okay? Dividend stocks, and the only stock I would really risk uh, that's a non-dividend is a Tesla, okay? So right now, uh, be careful. We're having these one-day rallies in the bear market, and Upstar is significantly down. If you look at the last three months, uh, Upstart Holdings is down well over 30%. So be careful with some of these pump fake stocks. Uh, they're not going to come out of this until we get out of these interest rate hikes. And, you know, it, it's going to take a minute to get out of this. Okay. But Upstart Holdings, again, they have some great technology. And on the day they were up 11%. Okay. So uh, that's the top stock of the day. Now let's take a look at the portfolio where we made the most money at. Okay, today's top cash gainer was Tesla. Uh, Tesla was the top cash gainer. Uh, let's see here. Uh, made a little over $600. In second place was Upstar Holdings, 11%, made about $100. In third place, uh, AMD. Uh, which will report tomorrow its earnings. AMD, uh, the advanced micro devices will report earnings. They were up early, late today, up 5.69%. And also I did like Microsoft. Microsoft got in on the rally action. They were up 2.17%. So those are some great stocks today. Uh, let's take a look and see if there was any opportunities. Of course, there was some red in the market. Uh, I did not buy anything other than Tesla. Um, this morning I bought some Tesla, but let's see if there was any other opportunity that I like. Uh, COP might be an opportunity. I had a few shares. I actually sold some off because I'm up over 138%, so I did sell some off. Uh, I'm thinking about selling some MGI uh, just because I think that's where they're plateauing at. Uh, but let's take a look. Let's see if there's plenty of opportunities. I like NVIDIA. I like NVIDIA under uh, $200. I think that's a great place you could be at is NVIDIA. Uh, again, they are a dynamic stock. Uh, they should be in 300 by the end of the year. So take a look at NVIDIA. Um, be adding to your position there. Uh, and of course, uh, Microsoft, as I mentioned, below $300. Uh, what else here? I like here. Oh, Apple. Apple uh, trading about 150, 158. Uh, I think Apple's still a good buy. They've got a lot of products and services in the pipeline. They also have a lot of subscription services. That's like pure cash for a company. So I like Apple. And last today, Marvel Technologies. Uh, they're a chip company. Uh, they do go in most of the automotive, such as Ford and GM. So I think once Ford and GM start picking up, I think Marvel Technology will pick up as well in production, et cetera. So uh, those are some opportunities, Microsoft, Apple, Marvel Technologies, uh, some great stocks to be in in NVIDIA. So those are my top stocks of the day. Again, you can join my private Facebook group called Top Stocks where I post videos of the day, some CNBC, also uh, what's moving in the market. I go ahead and post that. So again, you can join my Top Stocks Facebook group and you can follow me on chili.nj, uh, chili.nj where I post at least daily uh, one post about top stocks that are moving in the market. Again, uh, top stock of the day, uh, Upstar Homes up 11%. So I want to thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. Please like, share. If you'd like to get some free stock, please use my Robinhood link below. And everybody have a good evening. See you next time.